I won't drop you if you'll stop squirming about all over the place. Maybe we should just do this at home. Are you giving me orders already, Mrs. Lavery? Me, Mr. Lavery? <clears throat> oh. <laughs> Lights, air conditioner, combination radio television. If you need transportation, call extension 2. We're not going anywhere, thank you very much. That is all. Thank you. Oh, wait. Um, what? Um, right here, that. Thank you. Thank that's, you very that's much. That's five dollars. I know, thank it's you. fine. That's, thank, thank you very much. I hope you'll both be very happy. Oh, thank you. Yes, I'm sure we will. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Aren't mm. your arms broken? No, I could carry you forever. Oh, get a bit heavy. You're as light as a feather, Mrs. Lavery. Say that again. Mrs. Lavery. Oh, just the wedding day's over. Yeah, but the night hasn't begun yet. I know. I just, I'd like to start it all again and just live every moment. What are you kidding, including that nerve-wracking moment when we thought Robert wasn't about to show up? Even that. And you, you want to see a repeat of the case where spaces when everybody we did invite did actually show up? <laughs> Except Frisco. I want everyone's face when Bobby walked down the aisle without I came. Good for her. Yeah, Robin was beaming. She was very proud. I was very proud. I was proud of you both. Robin first, and then, of course, I was proud of you. You were the most beautiful bride. You were my bride. I hope every bride feels the way I did. Of course, not every groom looks the way you did. Yeah, if I'd known that whole kill nonsense would cause such a commotion, I never would have mentioned it in the first place. You look very dashing. You gave me something that not every bride has. What was that? A groom without underwear. <laughs> no more kill jokes. Oh, well, they were very funny. Some of them were very funny. Jake Meyer was very funny, but my heritage, it took a beating. I was very proud of you. Standing there looking so smart and straight and so Scottish. Yeah, Scottish I am. Mm -hmm. I'm glad we had the ceremony we did. Yeah, I'm sorry we missed out on the muskets all the same. The muskets? Yeah, it didn't quite seem appropriate, but I, I did search everywhere in Port Charles. I couldn't find one. What are you talking about? Well, it's, just, it's another Scottish tradition. Uh, like muskets, you know, you fire off a volley of muskets and... while the families go through the town and they gather people together, you don't really want to hear about it. And they all meet for the ceremony. Ah. Well, I'm glad we didn't walk through Port Charles. I couldn't have managed it on my high heels. <laughs> That reminds, that reminds me of something else, sir. Where are your wedding slippers? They're in my suitcase. They won't fit you. No, I know, but I wanted to drink champagne from them. Well, they you can't. They're lace. Well, I could, uh, I could try. Is this another tradition? <laughs> no, it's just something that I've always wanted to do. Oh. Well, looks like the management are prepared if you want to. Yeah. yeah that's nice. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Congratulations and best wishes. May you live happily ever after. Thank you very much, sir. We certainly do intend to. They thought of, uh, they thought of everything. They did? Look at the nuptial couch, for well, example. Quite a bed, of course. Yeah. Satin sheets, no less. Is it? Is that what they? Is that what they are? I don't know. Satin or silk? I can't remember. I maybe you got to. You probably got to feel them to tell the difference, I guess. I guess. So you did notice? Yeah. And when you pointed it all out. It's a lovely room. Yeah. It's comfortable. Is this, is this how you is this how you is this how you check these things out? I guess so. 
Do you remember what the man on the furniture store said? Uh, no, I don't remember what the man on the furniture store said. He said there was only one way to check out there. Is that what he said? Mm -hmm. I don't remember. He said, pull back the sheets. Yeah? Yeah. He said, fold them all back. Make sure nothing's tucked in. What did he say? He said then, then lie down. Close. Do you remember? He said stretch out. Thank you. 